welcome everyone to Do You Know Your Body? Today we have three very special contestants who will be competing for our grand prize of $100,000. Our first contestant is Maddie Woodstra from Atlanta, Georgia. Thank you, Maddie. Our second contestant is Katie Persons from Auburn, Alabama. And lastly, our third contestant is Hannah Sturzra from New York City. Thank you for joining us today, ladies. So I'm sure you all know what this game is, but when I ask a question, the first to press your tissue buzzer box will answer correctly and be rewarded 10 points. Let the games begin. Our theme for tonight's show on Do You Know Your Body is the movement of synovial joints. First question. Where is a gliding joint located, and how can you use it? It is located between the carpal and tarsal. Correct! What a smarty. Ten points to Katie. Now, can you show us how to use it? Beautiful! Correct again. Now, for a bonus point, can you tell me what type of access is this, gl this gliding joint would be on? A non-axle. Correct. On to the next question. Question number two. Where is a hinge joint located and how can you use it? It is located on the elbow and knee. Ten points. Once again, correct. Now show us how it is used, please. First show flexation and then extension. Flexation. Extension. Right? Beautiful. Ten points. Question number three. Where is the pivot joint located? It's located in the thumb. No! I am so sorry, but the, that is the wrong answer. Does anybody else know? Beep. It is located in the neck and vertebrae. Ten points for Katie. Now, what does this allow for? Beep. It allows for rotation. Correct. Can you show us this movement? Another question. What joint allows for flexation and extension, abduction and adduction, circumduction, and opposition movements? Beep. Ooh, since that was a tie, Hannah, first, what joint is this? Saddle. Correct. Maddie, where are saddle joints located? In your fingers or hands. Correct again. Now, Hannah, please display how you can use this joint. <laughs> Next question. Show the movements of abduction and adduction and what they mean. Beep. Abduction towards the body, adduction away from the body. Where is an ellipsoidal joint located and how can you use it? It's located in the thumb and allows for flexation and extension, abduction and abduction and circumduction. Correct. Now, with the score very close, Katie and Hannah are in the lead with 40 points, and Maddie is just not far behind with 30. The last question is very important. Double or nothing? What joint is this movement? 